so now it's all rigged and I'm changed and ready to go and it's time to put it in the water so make sure that it's facing head to breeze and simply walk through underneath the boom and the main sheet stick it on your shoulder and head off so we'll see you out there you're going to find here when you put the boat on your shoulder it's going to balance quite nicely you can see my left hand's holding onto the foot strap just to give it a counterbalance and it's really important to use the wind to keep the sail floating that's why I always walk it straight into the breeze as we get to the water be sure to walk it out far enough often you'll find you'll pull the boat up too early and the rudder and centerboard will dig into the bottom so always be sure to swim it out far enough you can see here in the video that I've started to pull it up a little bit too early and now I have to swim it out once you get out deep enough you need to get to roughly about shoulder depth and when you get out far enough you've got to decide whether you're going to do the water start or you're going to climb over the wing in this video here there wasn't a whole lot of breeze and because I had to swim it out so far I've had to do the water start one of the best features of the Mac 2 and most moths these days is having these inflatable airbags without those I would have simply capsized there so ensure that they're blown up as hard as you can